Allegations are allegations lah. It will be investigated. That's what investigation is about. Okay, so there is no such thing as a you know unfair prosecution. Tada, there's no prosecution pun. It's investigation. If it's unfair, if it's malicious, if it's revenge, your husband would already be in prison now. Terus in prison ya. In prison, rotan ke, denda ke, terus. But now it's investigation. So whatever you have to say that he was a successful businessman before even entering politics or whatever, tak apalah. So all that will be the subject matter investigation. So cooperate with the MACC, provide all this information. You nak cerita kat public untuk apa? What are you trying to achieve? Uh, to get public sentiment, oh the MACC is unfair. They have not even been unfair or fair at all pun sekarang ni. Nothing. They are just investigating, they are questioning. They are Sita bangunan tu sekejap to check whatever and bukan dia jual pembangunan tu so sekarang ni it is being investigated because there is an unexplained wealth so all you uh, your husband need to do you guys need to do you just need to explain the creation of wealth tak payah to the letter to the every dollar tak payah tapi kalau dah ada dulu berapa because MECC will take a snapshot where was your wealth at before you join politics lepas you join politics become finance minister the stint of time that you spend uh, berapa gaji you do during the period and how much your wealth grow how much did your wealth grow the business on its own and what business it did eh, that doesn't involve government punya funds situ gaji you berapa now what that business dapat contract apa through where through what means ada campur tangan tak of Menteri Kewangan masa tu which is the aim these are all the factors that will be uh, the stones left unturned by MACC MACC will call tengok jadi kalau in you may have already been a million air or billion air sebelum jadi uh, finance minister tapi by becoming finance minister you dish up lagi businesses to your Uh, business uh, 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 you bagi government your business pada you punya entities uh, your own entities and apa ni unfairly done ataupun inflated price uh, semuanya akan tengok if that were to happen itu salah so therefore janganlah buat statement yang husband saya dianiayai suami saya dianiayai kerana berjaya dalam perniagaan I think the more relevant act is that rakyat Malaysia yang teranyaya oleh kerana perniagaan-perniagaan penyakau-penyakau such as probably your husband not sure yet eh, tersangat berjaya jadi menyakau harta rakyat yang menyebabkan kita terbeban dengan hutang negara sampai 1.5 trilion ha, jadi benda macam ni yang menganyai rakyat rakyat yang tak ada makan yang dah hilang pekerjaan, hilang bisnes yang dah bunuh diri macam-macam dah bercerai because of masalah keuangan tertekan because ekonomi merundung dan uh, harga ma mahal uh, kuat currency turun jadi overall punya lifestyle of people semua tersiksa while you bask in the glory of your opulent lifestyle Uh, now, this is what is being investigated now whether did you take or did you wrongly embezzle uh, you know, must appropriate the rakyat punya wang kalau tak ada, then no issue they investigate, uh, jumpa balik rumah then go back and enjoy your opulent lifestyle tak ada sapa kacau just pay the proper taxes 
Uh, tapi kalau ada, siap, so janganlah cry foul. In fact, if you really want to help your husband, you best STFU. Faham tak? Eh? Jangan cakap. Senyap saja, tak boleh buat press statement. You bagi statement, you balik rumah, duduk senyap. So, at the end of the day, kalau husband you innocent, dia akan lepas. Kalau tak innocent, dia kena, then uh, face the music lah kan. Pandai buat, pandai terima lah akibat dia. Ha, jadi jangan buat cerita because AGMD kalau husband you kena prosecute ha, whatever you say now and whatever cerita you come up with semua ni boleh digunakan oleh prosecution and siaplah husband you susah husband you punya lawyer nak menari-nari nak apa ni nak mencatuhkan strategi macam mana nak tipu court susah kalau you dah pecah temelang sekarang so best just shut up now
So, uh, if you have any interesting ideas that can help build a better Malaysia, uh, please uh, put them in the comment section. And uh, if you haven't subscribed, do subscribe. Uh, the subscription is free, you don't have to pay money. And we don't, you know, uh, YouTube doesn't give us your information. So there's no list of uh, subscribers. I just know the number of subscribers, but no information about who the subscribers are. And um, we are not monetized, so there's no advertisements. When you click on our videos, you straight away uh, watch our videos. You don't have to see annoying ads. Anyway, now please subscribe if you haven't done so. And please share our videos uh, far and wide. Terima kasih. Wassalam. Anything in this video resonated with you, be sure to like it, share it with your friends, leave a comment, and as always, don't forget to subscribe.